your latest headlines and most accurate forecast from 41 Action News. I'm Caitlin Canute with 41 Action News. Here's a look at your headlines. A Kansas City police officer was shot Thursday morning while trying to arrest a robbery suspect. Investigators say the suspect robbed someone in northeast Kansas City, then got on a city bus. The bus driver saw it all happen and alerted police. When an officer boarded the bus, that's when investigators say that suspect shot the officer in the arm, then shot the bus driver. A fellow officer returned fire hitting the suspect. The bus driver and officer's injuries are described as non-life threatening. Mayor Quentin Lucas, meanwhile, reacted to that shooting, thanking the police veteran and the bus driver. He later went on to tweet, this is a reminder of the hard work our first responders do each day. I thank KC police and all who were quickly on the scene and kept the passengers and bystanders safe. In other news, Johnson County will follow Governor Laura Kelly's mask mandate. After a lengthy debate on Thursday, the Johnson County Board of Commissioners voted to adapt the state order. That mandate starts early Friday morning. Improvement on the job front. The national unemployment rate fell to 11.1% in June. Last month was the second consecutive month of job growth we've seen since millions of jobs were slashed in April. But the unemployment rate remains unusually high. It's still above the highest point ever recorded before the pandemic by the Bureau of Labor and Statistics. All right, we're looking at a possibility of an isolated thunderstorm here and there, but most spots will get missed. The forecast 70 in the morning, warming up to 80 by 10. Heat index near 100, 90 degrees tomorrow, so very humid. And that isolated evening thunderstorm is possible. Near 90 every single day right into next week, maybe a little hotter next week, with again that isolated thunderstorm possible each day with the chance pretty low. Remember to get your news and weather anytime at KCSB.com.